But I believe if they had life jackets on, he'd be here today. Yeah. That mom from New Carlisle lost her 16 year old son when he drowned Saturday. Good evening. I'm James Brown. Cheryl McHenry is off tonight. Preston Jackson died after crews pulled him from the water at a gravel pit along Osborne Road in Clark County. Now this was the first of three water rescues we've covered in the Miami Valley since then. New Center 7's John Bedell shares parts of his conversation with Jackson's mom and the message she hopes saves someone else's life this summer. Preston Jackson was just a few weeks shy of his 17th birthday when he drowned Saturday here at this corporately owned gravel pit in Clark County. You can see the water just beyond the tree line there. His mom told me why she's choosing to talk to us about her unimaginable loss. Um, hopefully we can save somebody else's child's life because this is the worst pain I've ever felt in my life. Amy Owen says her son Preston Jackson was an amazing young man. He just finished his junior year at Tecumseh High School and had a job too. He was one great kid and I mean there's just not enough words that can you know explain the type of person he was. He was very loving and family meant a lot to him. His family said he loved to night fish. It's what he was doing when he died Saturday morning. I just can't believe it. Clark County deputies wrote in an incident report Jackson and two of his friends were trespassing at this gravel pit near the I-70 and 675 interchange. The trio grabbed a boat they found and put out into the water when it capsized. Jackson did not know how to swim and was not wearing a life jacket. His friends could not save him and neither could first responders. Deputies wrote crews pulled him from the water an hour after he went under. Owens told me she talked to her son about water safety the night before. I had really got on to him and told him he needed to stay away from here. It was a dangerous dangerous um, pond. In this extreme heat and as we continue into summer, Owens told me what she wants other families to know so they don't experience her pain. To only swim in places where it's safe and to wear a life jacket. My biggest thing, I can't, I can't stress. If you have a life jacket on, my son would be here today. Always, always practice to be safe. Owens told me her son's funeral is set for Wednesday at a funeral home in Springfield. In Clark County, I'm John Bedell, New Center 7.